गुड मॉर्निंग एवरीबडी टूडे आई विल एक्सप्लेन सेट्स देयर रिप्रेजेंटेशन एंड टाइप्स ऑफ सेट्स द कलेक्शन ऑफ ऑल वेल डिफाइंड ऑब्जेक्ट्स इज कॉल्ड अ सेट वेल डिफाइंड मींस फॉर एनीथिंग इफ वी गेट द आंसर इदर इन यस और इन नो यानी कि एक किसी भी पॉइंट के लिए अगर हमें आंसर या तो यस में मिले और नो में देन दैट इज सेट टू बी वेल डिफाइंड नाउ सपोज इन अ क्लास आई हैव टू मेक अ टीम ऑफ स्टूडेंट दो आर इंटेलिजेंट सो इट इज नॉट वेल डिफाइंड बिकॉज फॉर वन टीचर वन स्टूडेंट इज इंटेलिजेंट बट फॉर अदर टीचर ही और शी इज नॉट इंटेलिजेंट नाउ द सेट इज ऑलवेज रिप्रेजेंटेड बाई कैपिटल एल्फाबेट ए बी सी एंड एंड देयर एलिमेंट्स आर ऑलवेज रिप्रेजेंटेड बाय स्मॉल लेटर्स there are two ways to represent a set number 1 roster or tabular form in roster and tabular form hum har elements ko separated by commas and put in curly brackets how will we represent look at this thing suppose i have to form the set of five first five natural numbers then in set roster form we will write Let us suppose this is a. First five natural number means one, two, three, four, five, and so on. So this is the representation in roster or tabular form. Now in roster form, one thing is very very important. That thing I'll make clear with this example. Suppose we have to write down in roster form set of all letters in the word better. So Again, I take. Let us suppose this is A only. Now B, E, T. Because T is repeating two times, but we will take only one time. E is already there. It means E, and this is R. That means in roster form, हमें जब भी elements को लिखना होता है, we have to write down repeated elements only one time. Now the another method, set builder form. Set builder form. in this form what we have to do we have to take any variable and we have to explain the characteristic property of the set through this variable it means suppose same thing we have to write down in set builder form to so set builder form mein ise kaise likha jayega look at this thing set builder form mein if we have to write down we will write a x such that x is a natural number x is a natural number and x less than 6 this is in the set builder form so these are the two basic ways number 1 roster form jisme hum elements ko separate separate likh kar curly bracket mein put karte hain second is set builder form in set builder form hum kya karte hain इसे एक कैरेक्टरिस्टिक प्रॉपर्टी से डिफाइन कर देते हैं थ्रू अ वेरिएबल नाउ वी हैव टू डिस्कस टाइप्स ऑफ सेट्स सो नंबर वन एम टी सेट एम टी सेट मीन्स इफ इन अ सेट देर इज नो एलिमेंट देन इट इज नोन एज एम टी सेट एम टी सेट इज जर्नली डिनोटेड बाय इधर फाइव और दिस करली ब्रेकिंग इट मीन्स देर इज नो एलिमेंट If we will take with one example, let us take one example. Set of all natural all natural number divisible by two. तो हमारे पास कोई भी ऐसा और natural number नहीं होता जो divisible by क्या होता है two. It means अगर हम इसे roster form में लिखें तो हम क्या लिखेंगे a either five or a is this one. So this is the example of empty set. Next singleton set. singleton set means if there is a one element in a set then it is known as singleton set let's take with one example for singleton set set of all even prime numbers to even prime numbers kya hota hai two only it means a is equals to what is this two so this is the example of singleton set now finite and infinite set for finite and infinite set we have to remember if the elements of a set are countable then it is known as finite 
otherwise infinite. Suppose I am taking one example a is equals to x such that x is a natural number and x greater than 1 and less than 5. So look at this thing. This is the example of finite set. Why? If I write down in roster form, look at this thing. Greater than 1 means 2, 3 and 4. So this is singleton set because the elements are countable. Always remember this thing for singleton set. There is one important term connected cardinal number. Cardinal number is always given for finite set. And what is this? Number of elements in a set. Look at this thing. For this set, what are the number of elements? 3. It means the cardinal number of this set is 3. And we will write cardinal number. It means number of elements in A, 3. So this term is very, very important. Cardinal number. Cardinal number kis ka hota hai hamisha? Finite set ka. Now, in finite set, if elements are not countable, suppose I take example for infinite set. So for infinite set, what will be the example? Let us suppose I take one example set of all odd natural numbers. Set of all odd natural numbers. So I'll, how I'll write? I'll write a odd natural number means 1. What is this? 3. 5 and it is not countable so we will put dash 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 so for any set if at the end it is dash 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 and there is no element it means this is the infinite set this is the property of infinite set how will we find out dash dash hota hai or end mein koi bhi element nahi hota next equal and equivalent set these two sets are very very important now for equal, equal and equivalent sets, we required two sets. So first, I'll take this three set to explain this thing. A, B, C, D. Then B set 1, 2, 3, 4. And C is the set D, B, A, C. Now look at this thing. In these three sets, number of elements are same. Here the number of elements 4, here the number of elements 4, here the number of elements 4. So we can say cardinal numbers are equal. So what is in this three parts? In this two sets, cardinal numbers are equal but elements are different. So whenever situation is like that, that for two sets, cardinal numbers are equal but elements are different, then the sets are known as the equivalent set. So a and B are equivalent set. This, this is the sign of equivalent set. In set A and C, cardinal numbers are same. Elements are also same. Order is change only. So, A and B are equal set. Sorry, A and C are equal sets. And this is the sign for equal sets. So, these A and C are equal sets and A and B are equivalent set. So, now, on the basis of this thing, you have to give the answers of this question in comment box. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share this video. Thanks.